Hello everyone and welcome back to another Die Cash Review. Today we have a Thornton's paint scheme from Kyle Busch in the 2023 season. I don't know why, but every time I see this Thornton's car, I think it says Tim Hortons. I don't know why, but I do. I, I don't know, like I'm not, like I've never had Tim Hortons, I've never ate there, have no significance in my lifestyle whatsoever, but I keep thinking it says that and I don't know why. Well, it's like Panera Bread. Every time I read Panera, I read Pantera. And I don't know why, dude. It's just one of those things that just... I read something and it's not what that is. So I always see Pantera Bread and not Panera Bread. I don't know. It's just weird. But anyway, it's Thornton's, not Tim Hortons, for whatever freaking reason. Uh, the Thornton's 2023 Camaro. Uh, very cool car. It reminds me of... Okay. I may sound kind of a kind of a big bag here but it reminds me of that donut box and i don't know what it is i think it's uh no not duncan what is it it's like the oh my god you know what i'm talking about it looks like a donut box and, and i can't remember where from but that's what it looks like and i can't tell why it's like oh my gosh what is that name what is the name of that donut company crispy cream oh my god i think that's how the boxes look but that's what it reminds me of so uh, tim horton's and freaking Krispy Kreme, which have nothing to do with this car, is what I think about, for whatever reason. So, I guess that says something about me, but, uh, yeah. Anyway, we're going to take this car out of the box and get a closer look at the paint scheme, because this thing's actually really nice. I like the little, like, circle patterns kind of fading in the background. I love the sharp, like, uh, almost like a backwards L, almost like a J, kind of. Very cool little paint scheme. So, we're going to take a look at it out of the box and uh, see what else we can find with the scheme. Here's the die cast out of the box, and right away I noticed that the uh, bottom rocker box does not wrap all the way around the bottom. Oh, that kills my soul. It's such a cool looking car. It's just like, oh, man, when it's not wrapped the right way, it really throws it off, and it just, I don't like it. It's like the B post. I see the B post right now. It's just a decal covering a white post. It needs to be an all black post with that decal overlapping it, but. I guess we can't have nice things. Anyway, it's still a cool paint scheme. I really like it. Yeah, I wish I ran a stop motion series still because uh, this one would be one that I would really like to have on track because it's just it's so nice. The white's really clean. The like the little uh, pattern on the hood goes to the side. It just it looks really nice. So definitely one of my uh, more favorite Kyle Busch schemes. This one's also doesn't really cover. Man, it looks like just a freaking. PTC car at that point, or I'm sorry, J mold, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. Um, it's still PTC in my heart, but anyway, onto the hood here. We do have uh, Thornton's, not Tim Hortons at all, whatsoever. <laughs> got the little uh, circles that kind of fed on the top, that looks really nice. Got the hood louvers there, bush on the front banner, of course, the Chevy bow tie. Then you got the number eight Thornton's once again, bush on the rear, name banner Thornton's once again, you guessed it, on the deck with there. Oh, would you know it? Thornton's on the back of the car. Camaro Z01 Lacuma. Got the uh, number eight there. Tail lights, Chevrolet bow tie. Uh, McLaren. The uh, custom grills right there. That was a super cool paint scheme. Bet MGM. Uh, met a net spin. Two winter stickers there. Rowdy. Thornton's. Cheddar's. Alsco. Got the number eight there. Uh, tw uh, not 23rd anniversary. What the heck? Is it 75th anniversary? Yeah. Yeah, anyway, so NASCAR salutes. Uh, I'm probably going to have to paint the bottom of that rocker box. That's killing me. Uh, Rowdy again. I already said that. Uh, Chevrolet Bowtie, Lucas Oil, uh, Sherman Williams, right? PTC, Comedic, Comedic. Oh, God, I don't remember what that one is. Anyway, got a blue Goodyear logo there. Goodyear tires, Sunoco. Got the number eight. It's got the front end here as well. Uh, RCR, all that fun stuff. Cat hair is once again, gotta love that. Thanks, Athena, really appreciate it. Um, get bioethanol there. Again, just, uh, the bottom's not painted and it sucks, but, oh well, if you, uh, kind of clean up this car a little bit, it actually turns out really good. Uh, I'm not a Kyle Busch fan at all, just never have been. Not really for any particular reason other than maybe some beef with Junior, but... We're going to look past that. I've just, I, no, like, legitimately, I've never liked Kyle because of his attitude. He's gotten a lot better since he went to RCR. But I'm still not really, like, a fan of him, you know. 
Uh, still a cool paint scheme, easy 9 out of 10 for the scheme. Uh, but with that being said, I guess that's all I have to say for the Sidecast review. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Phone